Here's a view of the galaxy cluster Max J 1423.8, taken by Hubble in 2010. Light from this cluster traveled 5.4 billion light years to get here. Note the large central elliptical galaxy at the center. Here's the web view taken in 2024 by the Canadian Unbiased Cluster Survey. They revisited the field using Webb's infrared capabilities. They used the cluster as a gravitational lens to find a galaxy that existed 600 million years after the Big Bang. Nicknamed the Firefly Sparkle, its redshift is 8.296. The light we see traveled 13.1 billion light years. Its mass is similar to what our Milky Way galaxy's mass might have been at the same stage of development. Since the image of the galaxy is warped into a long arc, the researchers easily picked out 10 distinct star clusters, which are emitting the bulk of the galaxy's light. They are represented here in shades of pink, purple, and blue. Each of these clusters are in a different phase of star formation. Note that Firefly Sparkle has two neighbors, Firefly Best Friend and Firefly New Best Friend. Here's an image of the full field with the three galaxies. The white contours show the lines of lensing magnifications that range from 15 up to 40. The 10 star clusters are highlighted on the right. Firefly Sparkle is only 6,500 light years away from its best friend and 42,000 light years away from its new best friend. All three would fit inside the Milky Way. Here's the spectra for the Firefly Sparkle, along with those of its nearby two companions. Strong emission lines and alignment break in all the spectra unambiguously determine the red shifts of all the components.